Welcome to an overview of the SC1608 DAC devices for measurement computing. The SC1608 series feature a USB or Ethernet interface, up to 500 kilosamples per second sampling, available signal conditioning for voltage, thermocouple, RTD, strain gauge, frequency, and current, up to 500 volts channel to channel isolation, isolated analog outputs, and isolated digital input output. The flexible design allows users to mix and match signal types on a per-channel basis and features a low cost per channel. The SC1608 series offers eight locations for 8B analog input modules, eight locations for solid-state relay input or output modules, and two locations for 8B analog output modules. 8B and solid-state relay modules are sold separately. There are four devices in the SC1608 series. The SC1608 USB offers a 250 kilosample per second sample rate, while the SC1608X USB offers a 500 kilosample per second sample rate. The SC1608X 2AO USB also includes two analog outputs. The SC1608 ENET features an Ethernet interface, a 250 kilosample per second sample rate, and two analog outputs. Two voltage input modules can be installed in the analog output location for both the SC1608 USB and SC1608X USB for a total of 10 8B input locations. Software support for the SC1608 series is extensive and includes Universal Library Programming API for Windows and UL for Android Programming API for Android devices, ULX for NI LabVIEW, TracerDAC for acquiring, analyzing, displaying, and generating signals. TracerDAC Pro, a professional version of TracerDAC with added features. DACAMI, an advanced data logging application for acquiring, viewing, and logging data. And DAISY Lab, icon-based data acquisition, graphics control, and analysis software. Linux open source driver support is also available. DACAMI is an out-of-the-box application that allows you to easily and quickly view and log data. The step-by-step -step guide will assist you through each step. First, the software will detect our device and will add it to the display. In this demonstration, I'll log two analog channels from an SC1608X USB device. In channel zero, we have a plus or minus 60 volt input module in channel one and a J-type thermocouple. Next, we'll select our input channels. Select a plus or minus five volt range because we're using 8B signal condition modules with a five volt output. We'll enter our units and add a value multiplier. For channel zero, we have a plus or minus 60 volt analog input module with a plus or minus five volt output or a ratio of 12 volts per volt. So we'll enter a multiplier of 12. For channel 1, we have a 0 to 760 degrees Celsius thermocouple input module with a 0 to 5 volt output, or 152 degrees Celsius per volt, so we'll enter a multiplier of 152. Lastly, we'll view our acquisition settings. Now we'll add a display. We'll add a scalar display and a strip chart, and add each channel to the displays. Now we can start collecting data. Each display type includes icons for you to zoom in and zoom out on data. On the strip display, you can add a cursor that shows the value of a specific data point. On all displays, you can scroll through the data. And once you're done reviewing, you can click Start again to acquire more data. A separate log file is created each time you stop an acquisition. For more information on the SC1608 series, visit our website, 